All right, so on this example, this is very, very important. Um, we're going to come up to this throughout the whole year. So it's really, really important that you guys kind of understand how this problem is laid out. First of all, this is 5 plus x divided by 6. I could also rewrite this equation as negative 1 equals 5, 6 plus x over 6. Please note that when you have a, an expression, um, separate or a binomial triangle or something divided by a quant um, a quantity 6, that 6 divides into the 5 and to the x. Okay? You just can't say, oh, it's just 5 divided by 6. No, the 6 divides into both of those. Okay? Um, so you could write it like this and solve. You just have to do fraction operations, but you could easily do that. Or the best thing that I like to do is um, whenever I deal with fractions, I'm just like you guys. I do not like fractions. So what I do is to get rid of the fraction. So over here, we had a fraction. We multiply by the reciprocal, which is basically going to be the same thing. If here is 6, this is basically 1 is in the numerator, 6 is in the denominator. So you could just multiply by 6 over 1, or just multiply it by 6 on the right side, and then multiply by 6 on the left side. Because 6 divided by 6 divides to 1, which is just going to leave you with the quantity 5 plus x. So now you're left with negative 6 equals 5 plus x. Now you can see that the x is being added by 5, because that's a positive 5. So then you just subtract 5. Subtract 5, and you obtain x is equal to a negative 11. Okay. Um,